Well, students at a Dayton school enjoyed an afternoon outside, but it wasn't to play. It was time, though, to remember. Katie Houston explains. Joins us new at 5:30. Katie. Today marked the eighth grade picnic at Edwin Joel Brown School in Dayton, but someone was missing. Ricky Turner died in a house fire earlier this month, and today his classmates pay tribute to their friend. Two, three. We love you, Ricky! Messages to heaven. Uh, it's just a really cool expression to make sure that everyone knew and he knew um, that he was loved and missed. About 87th and 8th grade students took part in the memorial balloon launch in honor of a beloved classmate and his mother. Tia Strickland and her son Ricky Turner died May 1st when their home caught fire on Pinehurst Avenue. Since then, students have been working through the loss and on a way to honor their friend's memory. We tried to help them with the grieving process by uh, making sure that um, conversations are happening. The students tied messages to the balloons. We spoke with one of Ricky's friends who told us what he wrote on his note. I said, you were my best friend. I missed you when you came over and all that. I love you. I said no more. I said, I'll see you soon. Students have also spent the last couple of weeks decorating Ricky's locker and leaving messages of remembrance and condolences to his family. He's definitely missed, um, but I think it's uh, really important to make sure that he's a part of this uh, celebration. And as for the investigation into the deadly house fire, officials have ruled it accidental. They say caused by careless smoking. Firefighters say it appears the home did not have working smoke detectors. Katie Houston, 2 News, working for you.